Now we all know that stress can mess with your body, so I wanted to share my top 10 tips to help reduce it before it gets out of control. My first tip is to obviously get a better sleep. Uh, for me, this means keeping my phone away from my bed and also taking magnesium before I go to sleep just to make sure that I can get a good rest. My second tip is to make sure that you're regularly doing some form of exercise. Just find something that you enjoy and do it regularly. I'm such a big fan of planning your day. I feel that if you find a way to plan your day that suits your needs, whether it's on a phone or in a book, that will help you get a lot more done and it means that you won't worry about forgetting anything. Another thing that I like to do is to have a cup of tea and some quiet time. And by the way, if you wanted to learn how stress can affect weight loss and overall health, I do have a blog post related to this video and I'll link that in the description. I am not the kind of person who can do full on meditation. You can find guided meditation on YouTube if that helps you. But for myself personally, I like to go into the sauna and I like to sit in there in like thermals and <laughs> lots of gear to sweat it out. If you've seen some of my other videos, you'll know that one of my favorite ways to chill out is to put on a face mask and just take the time to relax. Lately, I've been using the Rituality line by Origin Skincare and it's inspired by tea rituals. So the face mask that you can see me using, it contains oolong tea, chai spices, and a whole bunch of natural ingredients as well. And it just helps my skin feel really refreshed and smooth. Because it is a pretty natural product, I recommend you guys check it out. I'll leave a link in the description box for you. It's virtually impossible to get massages as much as you would need them, so to relieve some muscle tension, make sure you're doing your stretches, do some foam rolling, and do some trigger pointing as well. Call a friend just to talk it out. This can take so much stress off your shoulders when you're able to vocalize it. I'm sure this one is a bit of a no-brainer, but it's try to eat well. I know that if you're stressed, you may want to succumb to your cravings, but try and fill your diet with lots of healthy foods and make sure that you're eating enough. There's healthy alternatives available for just about everything. And my final point is the biggest one, and that's to identify recurring sources of stress and figure out how to get rid of them. So if there's something that's constantly bugging you and making you annoyed, figure out how you can reduce or remove it from your life. If you are new, don't forget to hit subscribe. And if you enjoyed the video, it does help me out a lot if you give it a thumbs up. I'll catch you next time, guys. Bye.